Let us show an example of uh, name pipe impersonation. This is a type of technique of a kind of, kind of attack and how Curator detects that. So I have a Kali session here ready to uh, uh, for an attacker uh, to come to us and I'm going to actually execute this mylove.exe actually going to run it as an admin and I execute that program and I get a session with meta interpreter and by just issuing the meta interpreter session get system what you get is that the system the meta interpreter is telling us hey you know I got a session you know uh, and uh, as an as a system uh, and I did it using my first technique and get system has several it will try several things so even got it uh, got a, a hit on, on the first uh, type and we had a, a curator system here clean if we refresh in here we will soon see an offense uh, uh, being uh, being triggered and here it is it's actually as I like to look I uh, like to do with any rule that fires. Let me see the rules that contributed to the offense. And we have seen this one before. Command shell started with system privileges. Okay, detected that. And then a pipe has been created following my updating services. So let's take a look at this. Uh, this is one of the rules that Mutas uh, um, also added to the Sysmon uh, pack. Let's actually look at, uh, at the events that happen in here and we're going to describe the nature of the attack uh, in, in, in just a second. We can actually look at the events and we see how Curator you know capture all the details of the of the creation. What was the nature of this type of uh, of attack? So if we Google impersonating a name pipe we actually get from Microsoft development a Several pages that describe the nature of this feature between double quotes. And this really basically is when a element that has a lower priority creates a pipe to one that has higher priority, then it impersonate inherits the, the, the priority of the other element, and therefore doing a, some sort of a privilege escalation. Again, this is uh, these are features that you know uh, they they carry a, a big responsibility from the security standpoint, and they are out there, and the hackers know know about it, and that's what you need to have your uh, curator system uh, with the with Sysmon to get that level of visibility inside the machine, regardless of any encryption of, and without having to deploy any agent. That's really the, 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 the value proposition of Sysmon. And given the, you can argue that the Sys internal tools are actually used uh, probably more by the hackers than by the, by the, by the uh, good uh, law-abiding uh, citizens. Uh, you need to have the tools out there. The, the the cat is out of the bag, as they say, and and you need to enable the detection of all these uh, type of attacks.